coming across this noise maker's name my name is Kay, and this is Gilder, and this is the godo family vlog so today right you guys already know right like um as a, as an african mother okay or as a, as a parent as an african parent sometimes you want to communicate something or you want to communicate a message or you want to send some signal or message however you want to see um across to your child and you don't want people maybe people may be there or you're in public and you don't want people to know what you are telling your son you know um now don't don't say oh so why not teach them the language see this house there eh, is coat of many colors when it comes to languages because i'm from a different place hobbies from a different place and um in between also our parents are from different places so, so some of us know how to speak our maternal dialect and we don't even know how to speak fluently our paternal dialect which is where we are from okay so yeah we have such challenges and we try to teach them the very 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 simple ones but again sometimes so now this is where pigeon comes to play this is where pigeon the nigerian street english all right comes to play so today i'm going to be we wrote down a lot of um, common pigeons, okay? Common pigeons that uh, we, we use in Nigeria. And, um, you know, I want him to be able to pronounce it. I want to be, wait him to be able to say it. And, and then I'll tell him the meaning or um, as we go from there. So if you're ready, so I'm going to be teaching him some pigeon. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah. So today we're going to be learning the pigeon language. So are you ready? Let's go. All right. So let's see. Let's see what you have. First one is Shay you won't collect. Shay you won't collect. So you say it with an attitude like Shay you won't collect. So your mom is trying to send you a signal, you know, maybe trying to redirect you about something and you're acting up and you'll be like, Shay you won't collect. Like, uh, do you want to do you want to get it hot? Eh? So that is what it means. So say it again. And you have to say it with an attitude. Okay. Say it with an attitude, let's see. Say you won't collect. Good! Say it one more time. Say you won't collect. Put your hand, give give it an attitude. Say you won't collect. <laughs> okay, let's see number two. Number two. I go change them for you. <laughs> Say it now with an attitude. I go change them for you. Say it again. I, I go change them for you. I go change them for you means, look, I, I'm about to switch from being nice to being hot with you. Like... I'm really angry right now and I'm about to, you know, I'm about to, you, you're about to see the other side of me. All right. That is what it means. Okay. Let's go. Which one again? Third one is, I go give you woto woto. Say, say, say it now. It's an, I go give you woto woto. I go give you woto woto. Say it again. I go give you woto woto. I go give you woto woto. <laughs> say it again. I go give you woto woto. <laughs> I go give you woto woto. I will give you water, water. Like I look, 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 I, look. I am going to give you like some excess. I, I'm going to I, I, look. I'm right. You know, you know how somebody wants to. You understand what I'm saying? Like somebody is uh, somebody is about to go hard on you. Let me put it that way. Somebody is really about to go hard on you. Okay, whether it ranges from teasing, from beating. We don't promote violence here, but you know, like. Somebody is really ready to go hard on you. All right. That is what it means by I go give you what to All right. Let's see the other one. Fourth one. How you did? How you did? That is a common one, right? You guys see us. You hear us use it all the time. What is how you did? How are you doing? How are you doing? Okay. Let's go. Fifth one. Shift till you come out. Eh? Shift till you come out. Shift till you come out. Like just keep going. <laughs> just keep going until you disappear. <laughs> Shift till you come on. Just keep going until you disappear. All right, let's go. Sixth one is guy show face. Hmm, guy show face. What do you think that means? Show your face. Like come, like come on, like come. Maybe you you're on the phone with someone and the person is like, oh, you know, like come over. You know, like you're inviting someone. All right, let's go. Seventh one is now condition make crayfish bend. Say it again. Say say it well. Na condition make crayfish bend. Say na condition make crayfish bend. Na condition make crayfish bend. Now say it with swag. 
Now condition make crayfish bend. You're not saying it with swag. See what mommy is doing. You're not saying it with swag. Say it with swag. Now condition make crayfish bend. <laughs> okay, nice. Your situation, something. Me too. I am trying, Abby. I am trying. Please give me thumbs up. I am trying, Abby. <laughs> now condition make crayfish bend. Alright, eat one. Now only you waka come. Now only you waka come. Hey, how do we interpret that? Please help us interpret that at the comment section. Now only you waka come. That was done by our popular first lady. Now only you waka come. Like you know, you are on your own. No, you know, um, you know. I, I think you are on your. You are. Is it like you are on your own or you? I don't know. Please interpret that one for us. I am trying here. All right, let's go. Number nine says, them send you. Them send you. Say, them send you. Them send you. Say, them send you. Them send you. They send you to me. They send you to me. Waiting. Waiting. Now, make make a sentence with it. I'll clap for you. If you're able to make a sentence with it, they send you. Them send you. Waiting happen. Hey! <laughs> That's a good one. Give me a high five. <laughs> Oh, you got it really right. They send you. What did happen? Like you are getting on my nerves. Like, did anyone send you to me? Did anybody actually send you to come irritate me? All right. <laughs> All right. Last but not the least. Number ten says, "Where you they go?" Yeah, you they go. What does that mean? Where you go? Where are you going? All right. And we are going to do a part two, a part two of this one. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up. Join this family. And like I said, this is a very simple way of communicating with your, you know, your words, your child. And if you're in public and you want to say something or you want to pass a message across and you don't want the public to know what is going on, like your child is acting up. You just look, don't look at your child. You be like say you want to collect what you want to make I give you what you want I beg. Eh? 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 <laughs> I hope you enjoy it all then. I hope you enjoy it. Okay, hope go ahead and, and round it up. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you uh, subscribe to all our accounts and like the video. Alright, so we'll see them. Are we coming back? Are we coming back with part two? All right, so we are coming back with part two. So watch out for part two. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Every day, testimony. Everywhere, testimony. See the word is working, and I'm so full of praise. And in the morning.